Here, Mexico City, a group of academics and drug legalization advocates gathered in a forum to discuss and debate the effects and solutions to the so-called war on drugs. For most, the 40 years of prohibition and criminalization policies foster anything but positive effects. For sure, what this has done is destroy the social fabric in many parts of the country, increase conflict, destroy our balance and tradition, and make the army play a role that it shouldn't play. Since 2006, Mexico's army has been fulfilling the role of a police force, patrolling the country's streets in its attempt to confront drug cartels. Although in the last 10 years, analysts estimate that up to more than 100,000 people have been killed, officials affirm the policy has brought security. I think that it is significant that we continue to get these results, but I think that we need to analyze in depth because without a doubt there is a great advancement in treating crime. We can look at the different crimes committed and see that today, as the statistics are, there is a decrease. However, according to the 2015 Global Peace Index, Mexico is at the bottom. Drug legalization advocates argue that true security and stability for Mexico will only return if drugs are treated as a health issue rather than security and at least regulate some drugs, really move drugs out of the criminal justice system, stop treating them like a, a, a police issue or a national security issue because they're not, and, and instead start to regulate them sensibly and responsibly so we can reduce the, the, uh, the harms of drugs to the maximum extent possible while also not creating violence, uh, uh, death, destruction, and other unwanted harms uh, from our policies. While families of Mexico's drug war victims continue to demand more support and resources from the authorities, Mexico has increased its spending and budget on arms with $2 billion in military equipment expected to be purchased during the current administration of Enrique Peña Nieto. Clayton Cantelasur, Mexico City.